You're, you're very funny and kind of approachable and affable. And you found that? So what? What happened? You don't think, you don't think so? What's, what's happened since then? Yeah. Well, look, you know, when you, <laughs> it's like power corrupts yes. and power corrodes, and <laughs> and power confuses. Confuses. So, I mean, I think if that doesn't answer it for you. Uh, something else will that I won't. I say. think I, <laughs> I'm, I'm totally confused here. See? Yes. <laughs> you must have a lot of power. Well, now uh, let's talk about burning love because I got to tell you. If we know, if let yes yes <laughs> why not we're here right? Yes. Let's talk about burning love. June, just you I and guess. I. How about just you I and guess. I? Sure. We'll just talk about you it. and I. I guess. Now, now, the thing I love about <laughs> sharing our dreams. Um, I'm sorry, go ahead and ask your question. Sure. <laughs> Is this the kind of shit I pulled on the <laughs> Kind of, yeah, yeah. But but you, you were a little you were you were you were this much more professional. I'm a little punchy yeah. right now. No, I know. It's a comic con. Uh, it yeah. takes everything. It's out a whole like yeah, you gotta draining. subtly adjust it for the different venues that you're at. That's right. AFI Dallas or what was it? AFI Dallas. AFI, AFI Dallas. Yeah, yeah. A little more sophisticated. Okay. Comic Con, look goofy, you know, so comic you books. The, so we have the goofy hat on right now. I got the goofy hat on. Yeah. Okay. Oh, and and you're here promoting like multiple things. So I mean, you you. It, June it, it's is one a, of those things where like you're constantly running around and you got to like think to yourself, now what am I promoting here? And yeah. What, yeah. I've got a lot. I got a lot of stuff going on. It's hard yeah. for me to make time for pretty much anything. Yeah. With the amount of things that I'm doing. So I. I, I thought she was gonna say it's it's hard it's hard for me to make time for a stinking little. Web series. <laughs> but she didn't. And a so stinking, I'm glad you didn't a even stinking put that funny out. little web series. Thank you very much. Yes. It's, it's Thank a, you. In but, fact, you could use that quote if you want. It's a stinking funny. Stinking funny little web series. Little web series. It all goes back to uh, my wife, Erika Oyama, who wrote the uh, series. series. Right. And um, she had this idea, and she um, uh, and, and we put it together, and we made a like a little pilot or sizzle reel and sold it to Yahoo and then she wrote this whole series and it came out really good and we got a lot of funny women and men to be in it and very I'm very happy with it it exceeded it exceeded my expectations on how how much positive response it got and how how many people are enjoying it well and you know it's funny I I can't stand those bachelor and bachelorette type shows I mean I understand the, 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 the appeal. appeal because like you talked about this in other interviews about how it's kind of there's that one half of people that are really obsessed with the shows, and then swept the away, other half swept that are kind of like looking at it like a train wreck. Right, you, yeah. you're swept away with the romance. So there's two types. I, I say there's two types of people: the people who are swept away with the romance, and the people who watch it ironically. Right. But there's actually three types, and I think I'm the third. I mean, I'm the third. I'm kind you're of a little bit of both. You're seeing the hilarity in it. I, yeah. but I'm also I can't help but be swept away. By it. <laughs> you know, I so can't both help. Both things are happening. Both things are happening. It, like there's, it's like the devil and the angel on my shoulder, and they're both like winning yeah. at times. Yeah. What, what's, the, what's the one thing that you think is kind of the commonality of, of like both the batch? To me, it seems like you've got these guys that they always seem like they're just a little more than out of touch with reality anyway. And then you have all these women that, that seem like they're competing over a guy that under normal circumstances they probably would never compete over. Is it just the allure of the camera at that well, point? Well, I think I also mean, they are in an environment where they're, from what I understand of the show, not really, they don't have access to television and yeah. books and any sort of media or stimulation. Any educational so stimulus. If, exactly. So if somebody, like a newspaper, or like, if somebody walks out who you're going to go out with, like just out of the doors with, right. you're going to be pretty excited to see them. Yeah. So I do think that's a part of it, what's actually happening on the shows, is they're a, a little bit like caged animals. I'm serious. <laughs> Weird I think, scientific experiment. I really do think they're just psyched to get out right. of that house. Yeah. Now, talk a little bit about working with Ken as a director. Do I have to? Yeah, yeah. Tell the, the, all the dirt and like, like everything. I mean, be nice, what's he like I mean, I'm, I have, directing I'm a you? I'm, a, I have a, I'm in a power position as far as like, the show is concerned. <laughs> He's wearing fireman pants. It it's, would it's, be it's... nice of you. And you don't even have to say nice things, but okay. like at least answer the question. Like in, in whatever the whatever you want to say about me, I, I don't care if it's positive, negative, but answer his question. Okay. And Mark, I want to. I just don't want to say anything. Right. It's gonna. 
no one, no one will ever see incriminate you. you. I, yeah, I do appreciate the job and everything yeah. that he's like, given me. But you're whispering, but I can hear you, and what? I you can hear you. I can hear you. Okay, I'll see you this much. <laughs> <laughs> Ken as a director. <laughs> Well, first of all, I've been directed by Ken before right. on both Party Down and well, that's right. on the finale of Party Down, your last, that's right. the last the, show of the series. My directorial debut on Party Down basically destroyed the whole thing. <laughs> <laughs> that's right. I never so put those fault. things together. <laughs> well, you're but taking you, responsibility yes, for that. Yes, you directed an episode and then this show so was no that was longer. It. Yeah, so it didn't happen you were the you George can make Clooney of that Batman franchise. <laughs> you pretty much destroyed the... <laughs> yeah. I directed it. <laughs> And then they never did another one. Exactly. <laughs> yeah, and and you also directed me in a show that was sort of a web series for Funny or Die presents on oh, HBO. Oh yeah! Oh my gosh! Called uh, USPD, United, United States, States Police, Police Department. Department. Which also, I guess, after you directed, didn't go forward. No, no. As a matter of fact, um, it went backwards. It went backwards. <laughs> they actually Hold tried it. to. <laughs> they tried to. Erase it, erase, it, erase it from people's minds. <laughs> okay. So this was not my first time being directed by Ken. Right. Although, actually, no, obviously you weren't in Party Down. But Ken had a Herculean task of directing and acting in this. Mm -hmm. and we, we shot 120 pages or so in eight days. Oh, my God. That's <laughs> yes. crazy. So when yeah. I saw it cut together, because he was amazing <clears throat> with the, you know, getting as much as we needed in the time that we had. But I, no offense, but I didn't know what his performance was going to be only because I know how rushed and insane the days were. Yeah. I didn't know what my performance was. Like, it was just very, we were all working very quickly. Yeah. So then to see what he actually, out of necessity, what, then to see what he actually did was pretty phenomenal, I must say. Yeah. No, the um, the fine performance. You, You're absolutely welcome. I will say that. I won't say a lot of the other stuff. I right. want well, to we, say we'll talk that later. is the one thing I will yeah. say. Right. We'll talk later off okay, the record. Okay. Great. Yeah, great. You can tell me all the. We'll, we'll talk later. I can but hear you too. This the, doesn't I, I, do anything. It, it's it, not it, like a. Sa <laughs> that doesn't block sound. <laughs> I wasn't reading your lips. I can hear you. Right. You sound it's a reverse like psychology. Literally went into this. We're not talking about you, but I was talking about you and actually so. The final episode uh, plays Monday on Yahoo Comics. That's right. right. The, yeah. the proposal well, was... The, 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 the proposal, season finale. The season finale. Yeah. The, the proposal was uh, this Thursday. Mark proposed uh, in a very exciting, uh, shocking episode. And then, uh, and then the last episode is um, after the hose, uh, women tell all. Yeah. Hosed off. Hosed off. Is that the title of the episode? I think it's called, yeah, Hosed yeah. Off. My, my yeah. camera one, Jenny, actually had suggested a title I thought was really funny, which was Behind the Hose, because there's so Behind many things you could hose. make of that, but, you know. <laughs> now they're giving Jenny? you, like, a long look. Yeah, there you I go. I really like that. That's good. Behind the Hose. But, Jenny, it's too late. <laughs> <laughs> nope. The but there's going to be infinitely more seasons of this, right? Well, if um, history tells us anything. Yeah. Uh, we'll it usually doesn't. It, it <laughs> <laughs> doesn't. It, um, it, there'll be 18 to 25 more seasons of this. Yeah. Burning Love, it's really, really funny if you haven't seen it, especially if you like those Bachelor, crap Bachelor, Bachelorette shows. It's really funny if you're, like, into that crap. I, honest, Honestly, <laughs> d just honestly, don't be a jerk. Watch it. Yeah. You will, you will, you will get sex if you watch Burning Love. You, I will, I will, I will, I guarantee you, I promise, that I will pay each and every person who watches it $150. There's no way. That's I thought you were going to say like a buck or something. Like $150. That's okay. Per person, I, get, I promise. Or, or one of these calendars. Maybe it'll be one of the two. So, um, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. I guess, hi, Mom. I'm not sure how to sign Hi, Mom. Out. That's, that's the end of it. All right. Burning love. Thank Pick you, sir. Thank, Thank you. you. Appreciate, Appreciate it. Appreciate it. Yeah. Am I your last you. one of the day? Yes, sir. Really? Yeah. Oh, okay, good. Oh, really? Well, that that's it? That was a blast.